Shalom, shalom. Um, but for the time where I'm at now in my life and doing this ministry, man, I, I can't see myself doing anything else, man. Like, I'd be compelled, man. I'd be out there. I'd be ordained. I'd be like, I can hear it. I can hear it. Go now. This, this is the one. You know? And you see me some days when I'm, you know, I'll be trying to do a video and I, I, don't, I don't feel the spirit. You know? I saw this in a, in a reading until it kicks in. And they kick, that's what you know when it kicks in. The spirit kicks in, man. And you be like, yo. I was walking here, man. I asked the Lord, I said, give me one more for one more game. Let me get out there. Let me feel, let me get one. You know, I'm trying to get all this other shit done. I'm like, yo, I'm, you know, the Lord, you know, I, I was trying to get something fixed. But then the guy said, nah, that you don't need that. You know, you need this. So he ended up fixing that, but there's still a little problem with it. So I got to go back to where I got the shit from and tell them they got to put that part in. They said they got to do it. So, you know, so, you know, it just, you know, everything is timing. I will wrap his eye, it, it'll be better. So other than that, I mean, we here, man. You know, why do y'all watching me all shots again to this point, man? You know? Rockatay Yahweh, Brakta Yahusha, Brakta Yahweh, Brakta Yahusha, by Shimon Conquer. Gosh, getting to this point, man. This wasn't easy, but it's worth it. Hold on, let's go back. So we on our watch. We out here. We focus. We know that um it ain't easy, but it's worth it, man. Cause we looking at this place because it's garbage, man. And who like I said, man, just on the place about Babylon ought to be destroyed. Just hearing that. And learning that Babylon back then wasn't destroyed by any, um, um, uh, how you say, w uh, wars. It was, it was a, a strategic strike. Okay? So they ain't talking about that Babylon. The daughter of Babylon ought to be destroyed. Let's, let's see about that. Oh, daughter of Babylon ought to be destroyed. Bible verse. What that says. Psalm chapter 137. Psalm chapter 137, verse 8. O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. So, um, Babylon wasn't taken down by, um, Fire, war, it was a strategic strike. You know? It was, um, I do believe they were eating good, and then they eating the king's food, food, and they was drunk, and they, they got a, 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 um, bombarded by, um, by their by the adversaries. I do believe the Persian and the Medes. I remember, Salaki. I went off of it, Salaki. Verse 9, happy shall he be that taketh and dashes thy little ones against the stone. So that's in the book, man. That's in the book, man. That's in the Bible. So I see why they didn't want us during the time of slavery to read this, man. Man, this thing don't help nobody but us. And it only speaks about the poor, helping the poor and the needy. And not everybody, oh, well, well, over there, they were poor too. They eat rice out of under their hand. Off the floor with dirt. No, they fucking go. Esau is doing that to them. Esau is fucking up Africa. Esau is fucking up other countries, man. Ashashua is fucking up the whole earth. He got to be destroyed. He got to go. 
don't like it too bad. Let's go record to it, buddy. I'm happy to know this. I don't want to be Yasha. I don't want to be no damn. I don't want to be no two third. I don't want to be no other nation. I want to be Yasha Allah, the remnant. <coughs> but, well, who gives a shit what's going on here? Well, that's all we out here. When I watch, telling you that you should be paying attention to the real prophets. The ones that's telling you what's to come. Get one in. You know, um, you know, Lord will that was edifying. I got one more verse. We're gonna bring it home. All right, Yahweh answers the prophets. Yahweh Yosha answers the prophets. This is sponsored by Yahweh Shemuel's answer to the prophets. Okay, and I will stand. Habakkuk chapter 2. Verse 1, I will stand upon my watch and, and set me upon the tower and will watch to see what he will say unto me and what and what I shall answer when he when I when I am reproved. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna get out there. Get out in the highways, man. That's gonna be our answer to the Lord. And the Lord answered me and said, Write the vision and make it plain upon tables, that he may run that rid of. See, we gotta get out there for the ones that come after us to run. Like the apostles did, we gotta, they gotta run and read this. They gotta get out there and read this to the world. To the to the to the um to the uncommittee in the eon. Um, in, the, in the cosmos, <coughs> all three worlds, get out there so the world can know that Yahweh Shemuel Shah, our power is coming back to put us back on the throne, and we're gonna be the ones, man. We're gonna be sitting around here with these nobodies, looking at us like they're somebody. We're walking back, looking at them with their fucking neck all out, with their hands back like this. You see these motherfuckers, man. Got no fucking, no um, no imposter. Just all stupid looking. Mad at you, well, motherfucker. Maybe, you should, maybe you should. When you was king, you should have did the right thing. And the Lord answered me and said, "Write the vision and make it plain upon the tables." That he may run that readeth, read of it. For the vision is yet for appointed time. Yet, ooh wee! But at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tarry. This, let's go, go, let's, let's go to this one again. For the vision is yet for a point in time. And that's what the prophets did back then. They got a vision and they broke it down. And they said that they went out there and they made it happen. That's what we're doing the same exact thing. We're doing the same thing, man. All right? We're doing the same thing, bro. We out here on the hedges and we're telling you people to get your act together. Because the Abba Shemar is coming back. But you know the only one's going to get it together? But that's the whole for you. For the years, for the vision is yet for a point in time, and it's the point in time. Things is happening, but at the end, it shall speak, and it's speaking through the men of the Abashmal Shah, and not lie. Though it tarry, though it, it lingers, it is, it's, you know, it's, 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 oh, we don't know what's going to happen. Why you? You don't really care. You just want to fucking enjoy this stink ass world anyway. We gotta get the fuck out of here. You know? Oh shit, we gotta, you, know, you know what? We gotta go to fuck to work and, you know, pay, pay our bills, you know, feed our kids. But we want, we want a briefcase of faith, man. We want to show you that what we, what we have faith in, it's gonna happen. 
the things we don't see is going to happen. It's going to reveal itself, and you ain't going to have shit for nothing. Nothing, sir. Nothing. You're going to have nothing. You're going to fake me out by your own shot. And not lie. Don't it tarry. Wait for it. Because it will surely come. It will not tarry. There you go, man. When it comes, man, you're gonna know this is the moment. This is what we've been waiting for, man. Hey, man, I don't, I, I don't see anything else, bro. I don't see it all. Oh, oh, what about my feelings, man? Bro, I was looking, man. Nobody, these people don't care. They, they don't care. They, they say, these people, they don't like you. They don't like you. They don't care about your feelings, man. They ready to rip you apart, man. They ready to drink your babies, your little one's blood. They want to do all kinds of things to you, man. They want to do things to you, man. They, I'm telling you, man, they want to be like Kalikata. If I said that right. Back then, he was, he was, he was, he was torturing us, man. I remember seeing that movie. I can't remember why. Before I learned the truth, he talked about that movie. Oh, uh, he's the wrong one in the Romans. Man, I can't even watch that damn movie, man. So, you know what, man? We waiting patiently, man. But we're going to do what we got to do. We're going to stand on watch and make it happen for the Lord, man. We're going to get out here, man. We out here, man. So why y'all about some more shot for them? So, you know, just, um, just getting one in, you know. Um, I have to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahushua by Hashem, and Uncle Dash. So why y'all about some more shot for the apostles and the elders of the great name stone? Shalom to the Ankyum. Shalom. Boom, Yashaya.